need to open the run dialog. So to open the run dialog, we press the Windows key and R on our keyboard. And then we type in regedit. So that is R E G E D I T, one word, regedit, and then click OK. And this gives you access to the registry editor. So what is the Windows registry? It is a hierarchical database that allows you access to low level settings of your Windows operating system and some applications. So if you wanted to edit a registry, you could select the option that you wanted to edit. So let's say we wanted to edit computer name. You can see I have a folder and subfolders. So if you click one of the subfolders, it will give you access to the registry, say computer name here. And to modify it, if you right click and select modify, you can then edit that value to something else. Now, I would add caution for editing any values in the registry, just in case it has unexpected changes to your Windows operating system or the application you're editing. So to ensure you can return your registry values to what they were, I would suggest you take a backup of the registry. Now you can do that by selecting the parent folder and then selecting file and export. Now this will prompt you to save the reg file. It's a .reg file to somewhere on your computer. This is useful because if you wanted to restore your registry to the value that it was before you changed it, you can go to file and select import and import the reg file that you saved. And then your registry editor will be as it was. Remember to subscribe. Bye bye.